Last time on the dig. What did we do? Oh, the turtle. That's all I really have to say is the turtle. That's it. We finished the turtle puzzle, which unlocked a new tram. We got to swim underwater to a little cave. And inside the cave were items that granted us access to this new tram. So if I go up here, we go back to the nexus. I think we just need to walk onto this tram and see where it takes us. Turtle got done. Yeah. I can't get enough of our salt and pepper. Oh, sideburns? So Hal Jordan. Yeah. More cool tram graphics. We learned some amazing hotkeys last time, too, to help me get from screen to screen a little quicker. I wanted to see the graphic there, but... Yeah, Boss and Low, our favorite slash least favorite protagonist ever. Is there anything else to click on this screen? Just this door here, outside. Tram call. There's like a crevice down here. I think that's it. Let's go. Hey, Pepper, welcome in. I need to see the turtle incident, Loki. <laughs> it's tragic. This is cool looking. Oh, neat. We can click from here. This isn't a cutscene. It has us walk along this path. Be half lurking, listening, but also trying to go for a tiny walk. Enjoy your walk. I wonder if we just click to this little ledge and it has us, yeah, walk up here. Quite the hike. Getting our work out. Rumble, rumble. Can we jump across here? This says far side. Oh, and there's a boulder. Can we look at the boulder? There's an enormous rock on the other side of the gorge. Enormous rock on the other side of the gorge. That's all I can do for now. What do I have in my inventory? Throw my shovel at it. I can't reach it. More Boston Low commentary today. Part one didn't get very far, but I got down the hill, and that was the scary part. Okay, nice. The only other option is to go back down. Do we have a rope or anything? No. A tooth, a jaw, uh, some rods, some crystals. What does this tablet say again? Hmm. Not particularly helpful here. As far as I can tell. There's an enormous rock on the other side of the gorge. Hmm. If I examine the far side, we just go, hmm. Okay, well. This wasn't necessarily helpful. If I go over here, it just says up. Hmm. And tram. Seem to be our only options. Weird. What if I try to go down here by the shore? No. Okay, well, let's go back to the tram. Mom, hi mom, welcome in. Happy Friday. Why did this room end up being a dead end? Nothing happened. Tram's already here. All right. Oh yeah, I need to double click for my actions to go a little quicker. But we can skip this cutscene. Maybe. Am I clicking the right thing? 
Oh, escape for cutscenes and double click for walking animation. So last time we got the rod that gave us the code to open this door. We have a bunch of glowing crystals. We have some bones, a shovel. Al, welcome in. How's it going? And we don't know what happened to Brinks. He's alive now. That was last stream. Dang, we did so much last time. We revived Brinks. We brought him back from the dead. Do we have a rod that goes with this door? No. I think that would be a blue one, because this was the purple one, I believe. There's a huge amount of energy flowing along this column. Can we look at this one now? It's a rod. It's a rod. No, I can't look at it yet. Five geometric shapes. But we powered on this panel, but I don't have the rod with a row of four bright crystals. The pattern for this. Groovy room size lava lamp. I know, it's really cool. I don't have the password for this. Sparks. When this rock fell from the ceiling, it must have cracked open an energy conduit under the floor. I hate when this happens. We get like a cool new thing last stream, thinking, oh, this will open a new area. But it was a dead end, so now I don't really know what to do yet. Let's go back up to the entry. What else? We saw another ghost last time. Let's look at this one. It's radiating energy. What if I bring the ghost back to life? Here. It won't do anything. Okay, good good try. Lava lamp plus clock is essential if you're doing duration testing for video. Ballistic hi, welcome in. The dig is, is good. Um we're reviewing what we did remembering what we did last time, and I'm not sure where to start today. It won't do anything. I know, the voice lines. I can't use these two things together. <laughs> Spacesuits, plant, clearing. We're looking for Brinks up here. We're going back since um he ran away last time. Oh, there's like nothing up here. Wow. Can we use our shovel? Use shovel on dirt pile. Last time was the turtle sequence. That was the last thing we did. Um, we dove underwater and got the rod from the underground cave. And we revived Brinks, but that was before the turtle. And we opened a new tram, but we went, we just went to the tram and it didn't really get us anything. It, there was a, I can't use these two things together. there it is. There was a gorge and I couldn't seem to cross the gorge. Here, do we revive this? Okay, sure. Just bringing random bones back to life. This is fine. I guess too many bones are missing for this to work. Oh, thank God. Think before you use glowing crystals, Jen. Alright. Anything else to click? No, just bones. And clearing. Nothing bad happened last time. That's not true. <laughs> last time was a tragedy. Oh my god, the turtle sequence. I think we already went back to this area too. Engine. 
This alien technology is hopelessly ruined. Let's bring the ship back to life with crystals. Use glowing crystals with engine. It won't accomplish anything. Ah, not with that attitude. <sighs> chest. The chest is empty. Bummer. I forget what was in there. Probably our first engraved rod. Can I do anything else in this room? No. Oh, well, I'm glad we at least came back out here, because I kept saying, no, we probably don't need to, but we didn't check, so that's something. Is there a way to get to the clearing from here? No. A little bit of a slow start. Okay. I double clicked. Thank you. There's something wrong with my mouse lately, too, so that's been fun. We don't have anything to fit in this alcove. Where does this door go? Is this the trim that didn't work? That didn't have a call button? Never seen this game, but it has got to be the same people that made Fate of Atlantis and Monkey Island. It's a uh, LucasArts game, 1995. Hi, Beer Ice, welcome in. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Here, use a glowing crystal on the tram call button. It won't accomplish anything. Does your mouse have ball traction? It's one of those that have laser traction? I don't know. <laughs> laser, I think. I don't think it has a ball. It won't accomplish anything. Tusk. I can't use these two things together. I can't use these two things together. Yeah, this room sucks. <laughs> Might need cat hair removed? Maybe. I haven't done that with the mouse yet. I'm pretty good with the, like, little, um, what are they called? Air canisters with the keyboard and the desk in general, like, cleaning up, but the mouse I haven't specifically cleaned. It keeps double clicking when I only want to single click or single clicking, like, I try to click and drag something and it releases too early. Can't wait to see what glowing crystals do. There's something special. Reminding me I reached a point in Grim Fandango where I have succumbed to peeking at a walkthrough. We t we did. We have had to yonk uh, the previous days. Because some of point and click stuff just gets to the point where I'm like, you know, as much as I would doors, love doors, to click everywhere. every pixel which one is on pixel. stream, it's not always the best strategy. The switch might be worn out. Yeah, it might be. I've had this mouse since 20... Ugh, 17 maybe? 18? I can't remember. Maybe 2018. I want to go wireless, I think, anyway. Museum tram. This is how we get back to Maggie, right? Sounds about right for the switch wearing out, yeah. It might just be time. The not with that attitude remark made me think of Frisky Dingo, which is a cartoon I was on Adult Swim some time ago. I like that name. <laughs> I don't think I do anything gaming-wise that would that 
wireless mouse would be a problem for, you know? Not doing a whole lot of first-person shooters or things that require my reaction time to be... I don't know. To the split second. If I'm playing platformers like for Celeste, when we do the B-sides, I'm going to be on controller. And that's wireless, so I deal with that. If there's a delay, I deal with it already. Okay, we're back at the museum area. You used to have a wireless gaming mouse, and it loved to disconnect in the middle of raid bosses. Yeah. I saw you on CSGO competitive matches. Yes. That was totally me. Okay, let's get some more crystals while we're in here. You haven't gotten to the part of Subnautica that's 400 hour first person shooter story mode? Oh no. I hope it doesn't have that. I know there's uh, stuff upcoming that's more... It's not a battle mode, but like... They give you torpedoes, okay? Nothing could open this door. Not with that attitude. What about a tusk? It won't do anything. Let's go outside. Happy Friday. Hi, TT. Happy Friday. That's the fossil. Here's where the turtle was. But I don't think we have anything else to do on this screen. I got the MX Master 3 and love it. Wireless and you can use it on three PCs at the same time. Oh, cool. Scroll off screen and it shows up on my laptop. You can copy on one computer, scroll the next and paste. Huge quality life improvement. Yeah, that's phenomenal. That would have been amazing for my old job. We had so many computer terminals next to each other and separate mouses for each, but I don't think it would have worked in that setting. I think it was some of the show's production crew that came up with it. Don't know who it was originally going to be called Whiskey Tango. Yeah, I like it. Um, this. You don't know what this is. Oh, I can press and hold this. Oh. And now this is here? Oh. Oh, we're just gonna walk on a piece of bright light. That's fine. Where are we? Museum Spire. Is that little tiny dot us? Semi welcome in. Making beats. Dropping beats. Oh, we run to the center. That was so weird. Crystal form. It doesn't look safe to walk there. What happens if I examine it? This thing is so transparent, it's almost invisible. Okay. Use blue crystal. It won't do anything. This is the part where I use all my items. Wow. There's a signal here, but I'm not getting a clear read. Walk on light bridges all the time. Okay, well, in any you're braver than I. But not as brave as Boston Low. Here, have some glowy crystals. I can't use these two things together. Sure you can. Did I use a tusk on it yet? I can't use these two things together. Flashlight. It won't do anything. 
I can't use these two Tablet. things together. All right, I don't know what to do here. But it looks cool. It doesn't look safe to walk there. Isn't there another... Was there another light bridge coming off of this where we could exit? Can we just go to this piece of rock here? No? Oh, okay. Weird. Crystal form. This is the dig. Let's use a shovel on it. It won't accomplish anything. It won't accomplish anything. It won't do anything. Weird. It won't let me walk behind that. Only in front and around. Okay. Oh, I see. It's not another light bridge. It's the one that's going down to the crater. So do we have to power all of these on? Do all of the spires have one of these devices? I can't open. Why can't we open this panel? It won't do anything. <sighs> Pre-rendered backgrounds, yeah. The show in question focuses on a malevolent alien named Killface, living on Earth, though he's a joke of a villain, and a billionaire named Xander Cruz, who is trying to run his conglomerate in the first season of Frisky Dingo as well. Weird. What happens if I hold it even longer? Move this around on this symbol? No. Is this a diagram of us pressing the switch? I don't know. I think I tried using glowing crystals on this already. I can't use these two things together. Maggie, welcome in. How are you? Strange device. Lens? Lens? Just needs a little adjustment. Okay, so maybe it needs a little more adjustment. What does this do? Oh, now I can't hold this down? Okay, interesting. If at first you don't succeed. So did we have it the right way? And none of the its other ways works? Still doesn't work. I think there's only three positions it can be in. If at first you don't succeed. If at first you, you don't, don't succeed. succeed. It still doesn't work. Wait, which was the way that I wanted? Uh If at first you don't succeed. If at first you don't succeed. Is this it? I think this is it. Yeah. Okay. Maggie, I'm doing pretty good. How are you? Happy Friday. Happy weekend. Just chilling with Phoebe. She doesn't know where she wants to sit today. She's on the move. Come back on my lap. Come hang out with me and chat. No? Okay. You do you. 
He gets head scratches. We're going to the library. Wait, this is the library. Hey, Maggie. Yes. Robbins. Can I ask you about more things? Tablet, library, strange device? You won't believe what I found, Maggie. The central island and the five rock spires around it aren't just connected by underwater trams. There are also light bridges light leading bridges. from the spires to this amazingly transparent crystal above the center island. A bridge made from light? <coughs> I know, it doesn't make any sense, but it's true. Their technology is so far advanced beyond ours that I don't know if anything could surprise me now. Interesting. I think we asked Thanks. all of these. And this room was a this was a dead end. It had some consoles in it that we could click on. Yeah, console. I decided that has to be a control console for a data retrieval system. Reminds you of Chell from when Portal, yeah. Controls, different inscriptions appear. Sometimes different languages. If English comes up, I'll let you know. I think this is all we can do in here. This one's also a console. Oh, this one's also a console. Why was I having... The screens must be part of one large computer. So much trouble clicking on these last time. TT, thank you for using your channel points for the map challenge. Looks like the plant has permanently broken the screen. Can we use crystals on this? It won't accomplish anything. No. I can't, it doesn't seem like I can get to this console. I can get to this one. I don't think we'll be able to fix this screen. That gl was glowing red by our legs there. I don't think we'll be able to fix the screen. Okay. What do we do next? I have sufficiently backtracked. And I don't know what to do. Oh, we're halfway through a community challenge. Nicely done. Map challenge, we're halfway there. I wonder if the light bridge has anything to do with whether or not the different tram stations work. Because that's our biggest puzzle, is we've unlocked two tram station rooms, but we can't use the tram in those rooms. Thanks for using your channel points. Thank you, thank you. We need something. We need a tidbit. Does anybody know what to do next? Just yes or no. And then if you do know, maybe this rock fell from the ceiling, it must maybe we're ready for a hint. Otherwise, I'll just floor. look it up. I do still have the walkthrough open on my phone. I didn't close the tab. Yeah, I'm glad you all like the, the challenges. It took me a long time to settle on what we would do for those, but these have been really fun. Okay, let's take a little peek, shall we? We need we need to kick off. We need some momentum for this. Um I have the dig walkthrough open somewhere. I thought I did. Oh, here it is. This cat. Hi. What you doing? Is 
So we used it the one time for... What did I have to look up? Oh, the very beginning, because there was something I didn't click correctly. Dias, wreck, grave, dirt ramp, dais, nexus, BB, no. <laughs> Me! There's a band called The Dig that had a catchy song called Simple Love. Nice. Glad to be back. Glad to have you back. Thanks everyone who made it for for a nice Friday stream. Um Look at the panel. Museum Spire. Look at the strange device and hold the green button to make a light bridge. Exit the view of the panel and walk across the bright Human light beings. to. It turns out, are we? Uh, to do something. Amariah, thank you for the six months. Thank you for the prime. I appreciate it. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy Earth Badge, your emotes, your ad free viewing. We're so glad to have you. Enjoy the new six month badge. You should have gotten the six month alert too. Maybe it's different because it's a prime. I'll have to play it for you sometime. Uh, and happy Friday. Thank you so much. <laughs> Daniel, no. We got those puns out of the way <laughs> at, at the beginning of stream, through the other two streams. No, they're... I get it. They're funny. It never gets old. Um, Walk to the crystal, walk back, return to museum spire, walk through the triangular door and get the tablet. Get the glowing crystals on the left. Then continue left and go through the door to find Maggie in the room filled with alien technology. Brink's body. Use the glowing crystals on Brink's body. Walk right and use the panel at the left side of the red door. Enter the shapes from the red engraved rod, then walk through and arrive in the tram station. Nothing happens when you call the tram. This is so... We've done all this already. Brink helps open the door. Okay, we've done so much. Here's the turtle. Orange door, walk through, try to call the tram. No, wait, what? Enter the geometrics from the orange engraved rod to open the door, walk through the open door and press the tram call button to the left. Use the tram to travel to the planetarium spire, but we haven't been able to use the tram. Oh, no, you see, okay, this is, we did use the tram. You get to a large chasm where water washes up to the top of the other side. Oh, okay, we just had to click at the right moment. That's dumb. So which is the one that we need to go to? The orange door. Well, the doors are gone. It wasn't a dead end, but it felt very much like a dead end. Found the noodle cat, yeah. Number made that uh, emote for us. How do I know which tram goes where? This is it, I think. Oh, thank goodness. We're supposed to... What? We were just supposed to click so that we went with the water. I was trying to avoid the water. First time I ever did the wave all by myself. Boston. No. Some timing related with the wave. I was. I thought we didn't want the water to like wash us away, but apparently we did. So easy enough. Let's go look at another. Is this another light bridge? Overlook lens. That 
It should have turned on another light bridge, and it didn't. Bummer. Bummer. I guess when you abandon machinery long enough, it's going to get out of adjustment. Yeah, yeah, we gotta move the lens. Chill. Just needs a little adjustment. Let's try this. There we go. I don't think we need to walk back to the center. Plateau. And then there's a bridge. Let's walk over here. Crevice. Oh, another rod! Oh, this is cool looking. Oh, weird. This one looks very different. It's a glowing blue rod. It doesn't have shapes for us. Baby, you okay? You good? Maybe? Crevice. Yeah, right. Like I'm gonna stick my hand in some crack in the rock on an alien Yeah, planet. do it. Why don't you put a shovel in there? That won't work. Ugh. Why yes. not? Yes. Yes. Oh, that startled me. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. Let's use a tusk. It won't do anything. Let's use... I don't know what else I would put inside of a crevice. Let's put a, gro a glowing crystal inside of a crevice. It won't do anything. It won't do anything. We can go outside from here. That's it. What else should I try here? A uh, tablet. It won't accomplish anything. Let's use our little compass. There's a signal here, but I'm not getting a clear reading. Nope. It doesn't point in any direction. Nope. What about this one? It won't accomplish anything. What about the thing we just got? I can't use these two things together. Man. All right, let's go to the plateau then. Primordia is a fun and unique art design point and click adventure game. These games are so chill and entertaining. Yeah. Oh, we could use the flashlight on it. No pickaxe. Shovel didn't work. We've only got a shovel for big tools. It won't accomplish anything. No. Plateau. Oh, okay. New critter. What's up, buddy? Okay. That was the way fun. Have been going, I can pretty much bet that whatever that little beast just stole, I'm going to want it really badly in a minute or two. Perhaps. Clearing? Oh, that's. They called this a clearing. Play this back on CD-ROM. Amazing soundtrack. Welcome in, BJ. Yeah, the uh, the soundtrack is cool. This game, this game holds up. <laughs> I had never heard of it. Never heard of it as a kid. And we played a lot of point and click. We played a lot of CD-ROM games, but I'm glad we're playing it now. Maybe they're a friend. I don't know, Shamin. I hope they're a friend. The last time I was small enough to get into a cave that size, I was four years old. What did I click on? Cave. Okay, but we're too big. There's another rod. <laughs> I'm gonna put this away, and then there's a hole. Cabbage, I see your message, but it's not triggering the alert yet. 
Come on, stream elements. Let's go. Hi, cabbage. A small round hole. You use this in there. I can't use these two things together. I'm back and I lived. What an awesome emote display. I know they're beautiful. What the heck? Stream elements. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. It's being annoying. We have to improvise. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Cabbage, thank you for the resub. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy Earth Badger emotes. Your ad free viewing. I appreciate you. 23 months. That's really, really cool. And yeah, maybe we, if we find a cabbage, we can use it inside the crevasse. <laughs> Missed y'all. We're glad to see ya. I hope you're doing okay. We're doing some, uh, oh, rib cage. Where are you going? Some casual puzzling. What is this? What did I just pick up? place for everything and everything in its place dude what that doesn't fit here you are so weird okay just put it down So call hi. This is a point and click Scavengers puzzle game. Pick these ribs clean. <laughs> but the animal can't have been dead very long because the rib cage is still holding together. Okay, now we have a rib cage. Sweet. Let's go look at this panel. It's missing a part. It's missing a part. There's something moving in here. Oh, hi. Chase the little rabbit. Oh, weird. I didn't mean to do that. Did it go back in the hole? A lot of useless junk collected by that little thief. Can we use the pole to get the junk out of the hole? <laughs> got like a hook on it it won't do no anything. It won't, won't do, do anything. anything it won't, won't do, do anything. anything use pull with cave I can't use these two things together oh this game Sam and Max hit the road and day of the tentacle are both gems also puzzling but wacky I like it These two objects don't fit together. Are you sure? I think they might. They're both red, so. I can't use these two things. We together. have all these bones we're collecting. Maybe we have to build a skeleton. Shut tight and solid. Where did the little critter go? The last time I was small enough to get into a cave that size, I was four years old. Maybe we have to leave and come back? The last time I was small enough to get into a cave that size, I was four years old. No, don't pick up the stupid pole again. No. There's something moving in here.
Do you have to prop up the rib cage and make a These little don't make together. a little trap or something? Trap it under this thing. The hook won't support the cage in that position. What? Okay, but we're on to something. We have to de-age to four years old. I think so, yeah. That doesn't fit here. What was the other position it let me put this in, though? Pull with door? We tried these. Pull with cave? It won't accomplish anything. Pull with dowel? What dowel? I can't Where did the dowel come from? Together. Put away pole. Since when was there a dowel sitting there? A short metal dowel. God. Put the dowel with the rib cage. It won't accomplish anything. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. It won't do anything. I can't get over the <laughs> the amount of that doesn't work dialogue. <laughs> Okay, can I prop up the pole with the rod? It won't do anything. Can I prop up the pole with the dowel? It won't do anything. Can I put the dowel in the hole? That's a nice fit. <laughs> that reminds me of that one, what is it, a vine? The guy that just goes, nice. I can't do it properly. It won't do anything. It won't do anything. Now, can we prop this up on here? <gasps> oh, genius. What did that do? That sure made a lot of noise. Are we going to kill that critter, though? Probably. Otterly, hi, welcome in. Doing a lurk. Thanks for the lurk. It's good to see you. Just be listening to your shenanigans. Okay, sounds good. There's going to be a lot of them. This game is full of shenanigans. I think my favorite repetitive dialogue in a game like this is from Laura Bow and the Dagger of Amun-Ra. Every time you get an object, it's like you pick it up and place it in your purse. I don't know why, but it's lodged in my brain. Yep. We were talking about this a while back, probably with Pajama Sam, but I used to play this point-and-click Madeline game on our old, old, oldest gateway computer, the whatever, Windows 98, Windows 95, probably, one with the cow spots, and there was a mini game. I know this is such a tangent, but there was a mini game in that game where you had to chase your dog Genevieve through a maze and it was scary to me because you were being chased and you had to go and like outrun somebody to get your dog and both of you had to get to the other end of the maze and there was some line that was like oh no Genevieve that was burned in my brain for the longest time I think it's gone now but those voice lines just get stuck I'm amazed, amazed how much I remember from 25 years ago. I suddenly feel ancient. No. The cow print. I remember the one with the cow spots. I remember. I remember going with my family to, I don't know, the gateway store, the computer store. And they had this display of, like, the corner office desk with the gateway computer. And they had cow spot mouse pad and decorations on everything. Good times. They stay in your brain for eternity. Mm-hmm. They do. All right. We have one other thing that we didn't use, which is this rod. Use rod with... What? Pin? Cage? I'm afraid to use it on the pin... What if I do this? Because I don't want everything to... If only I had some bait for this trap. But I'll just have to play sheepdog fall over. Okay, now it's called a trap. Some bait. We don't have any bait. A crystal. 
It won't do anything. It's a trap! Okay, so if I go back to this hole, will it say there's still a critter inside or no? There's something moving in here. I have to play... Sheepdog? So what, I have to walk past it? The pin fits tightly in the hole. What am I supposed to do? The last time no, I, I don't care the about the cave, you odd. getting into the cave. If I click on this, do I do I Yeah. If only I had some bait for this trap. But I'll just have to play sheepdog. Okay. A thin metal plate with a button on it. Oh. What do I use this for? It looks like it came off the door, honestly. It won't do anything. It won't do much good to put the cover on when a part is missing. Okay. There's something moving in here. So do I just, like, hang out and wait for it to move under the trap? I don't think we've seen anything that would work as bait. Maybe it has something a lot of useless junk in its little hole. Little thief. No? What if we just do this? <laughs> Doesn't work. If only I had some bait for this trap. But I'll just have to play sheepdog. A lot of useless junk collected by this that little This is so weird. Thief. Oh, I keep forgetting I can skip dialogue, too, when we get repeats. No, not the cave. I didn't click the cave. Does it have another exit to that thing? No. Oops, rip. Hey, Landar, welcome in. Austin, are you okay? Wait, is there another way to walk back here? No. Okay. Shut tight and solid. So called, thank you for the lurk. Enjoy. There's something moving in here. I don't understand this part. Get that little critter to run back the other way. The last time I was small enough to nope. get into. Hey, Daxon, welcome in. The pen fits tightly in the hole. What do we use this other rod for? I can't use these two things together. I can't use these two things together. Uh, just played some Mario Party in which I was totally unlucky. And some Phasmophobia. Nice. Good start to the weekend. something moving in here uh, 
Okay, there's two holes. A lot of useless junk collected by that little thief. Oh, this is funny. Something about the horrible rumbling cave is very cozy. This has a better, I would say, cozier sound effect than some of the other areas. A lot of useless junk collected by that little thief. There's something moving in here. A lot of useless junk collected by that little thief. So weird. A lot of useless if junk I click back and forth between these, does it always go to the other one, or do I have to like reset from the other side of the room? So far, we've only gotten it to take one walking path. It seems like. Last time I was small enough mm. to get into a cave, that- Stop reading the cave dialogue. It doesn't do anything. Can we block these holes? It won't accomplish anything. It won't do anything. Really? We can't cover the hole so that it can't go back inside? Trying to flashlight in the anything. hole. It won't accomplish anything. There's something moving in here. I don't know where else to go. I can't walk in any particular direction that'll make it go another way. Maybe we maybe we do have to come back with bait, but I haven't seen any bait. Do we have cuz we don't even have food. We don't have any rations. We're starving to death. Lot of useless junk <sighs> Oh, there, I got past it that time. Oh. Let you out, you'll head for the place where you hide nice shiny machinery parts. The only trouble is, how am I gonna follow you? What? How am I gonna follow you? It's a small trapped alien critter. Here, have a life crystal. He's already too lively. <laughs> How am I gonna follow you? I don't know. Use this. <laughs> There's a signal here, but I'm not getting a clear reading. I don't understand. It doesn't point in any direction. If we die, we have the life crystals? Yeah. We can just use those. This poor critter! I feel so bad! I can't use these two things together. Danny, Human hi, welcome in. It turns out, are weird. Bran, thank you for gifting a sub. I appreciate it. Thanks for giving a sub to VJ. Enjoy your Earth Badger emotes, your ad previewing, courtesy of Bren. Welcome to the human race. 
Thanks, Bren. Thanks for that gift. What does my Pokedex say about this critter? Wiggly critter. Susceptible to traps. I don't know. What happens? So if I click on the trap, does it release it? Oops. Yeah, we have to like redo the trap. Go, little creature. Roam free wherever your thieving little heart desires. It goes into the cave, but we can't get into the cave. So what the heck are we supposed to do? The last time I was small enough to get into a cave, that I can't use. Can we make the cave together. entrance bigger? Sorry, friend, but you're. Oh. Really digging. We're digging. Yes. That looks big enough to squeeze. Okay, through. go into the cave. So we didn't even have to trap the critter? Weird. I hear you squeaking in here. What can I click on? Opening. That's it for now. It's the game title. Yes. Critter hole. Critter hole. It's the critter's empty nest. Cute. Okay. It's the critter's empty nest. Thought it was just a metaphor. <laughs> no, it's um. We've we've how many times have we done digging? Done digging? Have we dug <laughs> in this game? Twice, I think. But we do have an archaeologist on our team. But he spent a little, a small portion of the game, um, dead. I like this. It's I like this nest. emote. A Wiimote shovel. <laughs> so now that we're down here, what do we do? Keep digging. It's the critter's empty nest. Oh, that was weird. Because it has the part we need buried down it's here somewhere, I think. It's the critter's empty nest. I truly don't understand. This room was just a dead end with a bunch of holes. Are we supposed to open up all of these? Because we don't even have the parts to trap the critter again. It won't do anything. It won't do anything. There's something moving in here. We just follow you now? I had a thought, but I don't know if it's valid. I'm 100% completely unfamiliar with this game. I almost forgot I had paused Star Trek, so I'm gonna lurk while finishing the episode. Sounds good. What episode? The little critter probably gives the best hug. So many arms. <laughs> We got into the cave, and it's, they said we need to be able to follow the critter. So are we supposed to know which of these holes the critter goes into and puts all of its treasure? Oops, I didn't mean to click over there. Oh, second episode from Picard. Nice. Enjoy. It's the critter's empty nest. Poke it. Poke it with a stick. 
I can't use these two things together. Go get with a tusk. It's the critter's empty nest. So weird. Can we go this way? Is this actually ground for us to work on? It looks like a ledge. Oh, the rod's on the ground now, so we can retrap them. A thin metal rod. We just have to use it oops on this thing again. If only I had some bait for this trap, but I'll just have to play sheepdog. There's something moving in here. What did we do last time we walked around in front of it and somehow that didn't startle it? Yeah. No. Oh, okay. We got it. But then we now have to release it and watch it. If I let you out, you'll head for the place where you hide nice shiny machine. Watch it run to the cave. But we needed to. The trouble is, how am I gonna follow? Open you? this door before we released it. Maybe. It's a small trapped alien critter. And now follow it. Go, little creature. Roam no, free don't use a rib cage with the cave. Just go in the cave. I'm so confused. What did they want me to do? It's the critter's empty nest. It's the critter's empty nest. It's the critter's empty nest. We gotta set this up all over again. This stupid trap. It's a thin metal rod. I don't care. If only I had some bait for this trap, but I'll just have to play sheepdog. There's something. Okay, is there something... Yeah, sure, Jeffrey. Is there something that we are supposed to put on it so that we can follow it? We need to put a tracker. But I don't have anything like that. Nice shiny machinery parts. The only trouble is, how am I going to follow it? I thought the answer of how we would follow it was by increasing the size of the entrance to the cave. Am I supposed to put something down on the floor of the cave and then we can see its tracks? It's the critter's empty nest. What it what are what am I holding? What is this thing? Break this glow stick and put it on the floor. It won't do anything. And then it'll walk across the glow it won't stick do anything. and leave tracks to the it won't right anything. hole. Use the jawbone with the glow I can't stick. Use these two things together. It won't do anything. What in the world? Here. It won't accomplish anything. I can't use these two things together. Mm 
I think I tried this too, this right? Critter's empty nest. All right, I'm gonna look it up. Today is a rough one. These are so tedious. Classic point and click. Blah, blah, blah. Make a cage. There's an item we don't have. It says use the bracelet. What, 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 what bracelet? Alright, we're just leaving the critter. Sorry, buddy. No, that's cruel. No, go back. I can't do it. We can retrap it. No, don't go in the cave. Gosh darn it. Boston, you're killing me. Okay, I guess we'll keep the rib cage. What was over here? The crevice? No bracelets over here. Where were we supposed to pick up a bracelet? Do it. Like Put your hand in there. In some crack in the rock on an alien planet. No, we already used the flashlight on it. Use the glow stick on the crevice. It won't accomplish anything. Oh, this game. This is where we came in, right? Were we supposed to walk out into the center once we made this um, light bridge? Where does it say overlook? Oh, that's where we came from, I think. Beings. It turns out are weird. Welcome in. Thank you for the resub. Thank you for 20 months. I appreciate it. How are you? Enjoy Earth Badger emotes, your ad free viewing. We're so glad to have you. The blue orb is like a compass, Wily. But it I don't I don't know exactly when or why it helped us earlier in the game. But I don't know what it, what it reacts to. Okay, this is very beautiful, but there's no bracelet. It doesn't look safe to walk there. Do it. <laughs> Hi friends, happy Friday, happy weekend. Let me read and see where this bracelet item was that we missed then, because I don't know where to find that. Uh, how do I do control F on a phone? Here we go, find it page. Oh, interesting. We did try to dig out in the clearing, but we couldn't dig until we used the compass. It does have to do with the compass. That's dumb. Time for me to make dinner and lurk. Have a good lurk and a good dinner. Thanks, Amariah. We got a way backtrack now. What a pain in the butt. I'll never make it this Yes, direction. you will. I'll, I'll never make it this direction. You'll be fine. Oh, did we soft lock? Do we no, well, we have to go out the other spire. Ugh. Oh right, we have to hit the tram call.
It's a fun game. It's just, point and clicks always get to a point for me where it's like, okay, what do I do? Like, I don't want to sit here combing through every pixel. I want to get to the good stuff. I want to know how it ends. So you pull it out a while ago and it seemed like it needed something to lock in on. It helped us with some of the doors in the Nexus in the beginning. But most of the rooms I've been in since then, it just spins and says, I, I can't get a good signal here. And I think it pointed us towards the ghosts maybe early on? Unclear. Wait, did I pass the... No, it's over here. Hey, Dronin, welcome in. We are back to the dig. We're gonna try to finish it today if we can. Just every other pixel. Yeah. <laughs> this is where we need to use it. Which is weird, because I tried digging this mound. It seems to be pointing at this But mound. there was no... Uh, like, when you hovered over it, it didn't say small mound yet. You need something to interact with. We're gonna dig again. Dig, With dig, that device dig, pointing dig. at this mound, I suspect there might be something. Good job, Boston. Big brain. <laughs> Here we got a stupid bracelet. There's nothing more to dig up. It looks like a bracelet. Yeah, put it on. Cute. I wonder who he's talking to, right? Who is he talking to? I wish we could go up this into onto the light bridge. It's radiating energy. Just ride up the let ride up the light. It's radiating energy. It's kind of game where the character's knowledge can sometimes affect the interactivity. Yeah. Um, we can just go back. To this one. Some people process externally, I do, but these characters are a bit much for simply thinking out loud. Mm hmm. What is he, a streamer? Is it the... yeah, it's the plateau. No, I didn't mean to click that. We gotta trap this critter. A thin metal rod. Oops, I need to put the... A thin metal rod. Cage down first. Then I need to use the metal rod to prop it up. If only I had some bait. No, don't tell me about sheepdogs right now. There's something. There are characters like Link who are so quiet they have to have other characters tell them what they're thinking. Yeah. Commander Lowe never asks us to follow or subscribe. <laughs> now I've got you. Gotcha. If I let you out, the only trouble is. Blah blah blah. No, not with the trap, with the critter. I can't use these can't two use things these together. Two things together. Now what? It's a small alien critter with an electronic How collar. did we know the collar was electronic? Okay, but we can use our compass to figure out where it is. Fun. How do I... There we go. Release the trap. It's all making sense now. Go, li go little buddy. It's got to be right under here. This is where the tracker's pointing. 
tracker spot. We dig again. <gasps> dig him out. What if I hadn't brought this shovel along? It wouldn't be the dig if you hadn't brought a shovel. No, that's not worth thinking about. That's so funny. They gave us so much crap in the beginning of the game for wanting to bring a shovel, shovel the on a sure space like mission. He took off down one of his tunnels. Okay, but we don't care where the critter goes. Now maybe I can get the door open. That is interesting. If we track it again, will it tell us where the critter is again? It's indicating to the right. Critter holes over here. It's the critter's empty nest. Oh well, we don't care. I'm assuming we don't need to keep these items, although we have a pretty large inventory. We might as well take them with us. Maybe we need to build another trap again somewhere else. A thin metal rod. Human beings, it turns out, are weird. Engineer, welcome back for 16 months. Thank you for the resub. Enjoy. Your earth badge, your emotes, your ad previewing. We're so glad to have you. Thanks for those subs today, friends. Thanks for all the hype. Happy Friday. Let's go fix this door. Now with any luck, this will work. I sure hope it works. Now let's get this thing closed up and see if it works. <gasps> Hooray! Yay! Just getting home and getting cozy. Nice. Yay, cozy. Alright, we've got twin scepters, another hole, a green engraved rod, a button, a faint light. Let's get the rod first. It's a rod. Solarum, welcome in. Hello, hello. Another one of these engraved sticks. More geometric rooms. Yeah. A crack, a plate. Oh, we need the plate too. Take that with us. That's important. I can see outside. Oh, take a look. Oh, or not. Okay. A pedestal designed to hold the scepters. Okay. Hmm. hmm. What happens if I press the button? Is this a quantum room? What's gonna happen with this room? Do we close the light the door and then turn out the lights? And shine a flashlight on the scepter? The scepter heats the case of the flashlight when they are held together. Okay. That did something. What happens if we take it? The scepter seems to have an electrical charge. Interesting. What happens if we put one of these other things here? No, we can't put the blue crystal here. Put this with the faint light. We can totally reach up there. It won't accomplish anything. This is weird. Oh, they're separated now. Silver scepter. I can't put them back on this the pedestal. Gold scepter. Never seen that interaction before? Yeah, that was that told us something. Use this with a button. The button didn't do anything. I can't use these two things together. Let's put a life crystal on the pedestal. Nope. 
Weird. Can we examine the pedestal? Can we look outside through this crack? I can see outside. What's outside? You're not gonna show us the screen for it? I know, Bren. This plate on the wall is movable. Our, uh, <laughs> our protagonist is so negative. It's movable. Yeah, we push it and nothing happens. Okay. I can't use these two things together. Poke it. Poke it with a rod. I can't use these two things together. Poke it with a shovel. I can't use these two things together. Use our cool compass. It's pointing behind me. Do we think we do something else in here? Or are we just supposed to pick up items in here? Uh, this thing's a little hard to read. I think it's a map, kind of. If I had to guess. Like, these are the different paths off of the Nexus. This is the stairway down to that thing below the Nexus that we used. Maybe. I don't know. This looks like the different spires, almost. It's kind of cool. What's up with this light? Oh, if I open the inventory, we don't get the hmm. interaction. Someone thinks the map is very clear and easy to read. Does that mean they're an alien asking for a friend? <laughs> I don't know. It won't do anything. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. It won't accomplish anything. Uh, I don't know, Jeffrey. Let's do it again. Hmm. Highly and welcome in. How are you? Happy weekend. I'm bummed that this button doesn't seem to do anything. Maybe it opens the door when the door isn't as broken as it is now. No, not the cave. I don't want the cave dialogue. I don't want to walk down there. No! <laughs> I hope you're having a good day. Question two, can we dig it? I think I tried the shovel with the crack. I don't know if I tried the shovel with the button, but we, we got some new items. I'm confident we can go back and do something else. I'm gonna take my hair out of this ponytail so it dries better. I'm kind of cold with wet hair. Um, We have a new engraved rod. We can go through another door in the Nexus and we have the plate. So I think we're going to use those. I don't know what to do with the scepters yet but we'll hang on to them. They seem cool. We want to go this way so that we can cross on the light bridge, yeah. And back to the museum spire, and back here. Oh, more thunderstorm. Back to the tram. I love this quick cutscene thing. It is such a lifesaver.
Maybe the maybe now the scepters are what we need for that control room area. That could be it. It has holes in the ground. Maybe we put the scepter in the hole. <laughs> now is this the green door? I think this is the only one that's still open that doesn't have a panel that's completely blocked off with rocks. So let's take a look. Uh, blue D4, green D4, blue D6, blue D12, blue, green, blue, blue. Thank you, Jeffrey. I gotta cycle through to get green again. Shapes are dice, yeah. I'm learning my dice better. We did it! We did it! What's gonna be in here? Oh wait, let's put the panel back on that other thing before we leave. Where is it? I'm probably going the long way around, that's okay. No, here. This is what we want. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. We've got one left. Let's go check it out. Uh, and then I think we'll break relatively soon. I don't know, maybe 15 more minutes? This area is broken down. I don't think we can go to the left. Nope. We're going up the ramp, okay? Another trim call button. Does this one work? Yeah. Um. Cool. Let's go. can't see where we are. It says tram call. Tram. Can we not really go anywhere from here? Just jump across, buddy. a cool oh ledge okay gold window yeah pretty wow we're having a good time in here I think so we're finding new stuff some of these overlooks are so pretty we've got a cavern I hear some animal noises an opening Can we walk this way? Oh, wow. Love the art in this game. It is really pretty, yeah. Lo needs his camera time, I know. Naki, hi. I dig the color palette, me too. I was gonna go into this opening first, but we walked up here instead, so I guess we'll go in the cavern. 
I don't know where these growls are coming from. Back to the ledge. Hit. Scary. Okay, yeah, let's jump in. Bats, alien bats, another opening. Chamber was the room we were in before, that's what they're calling it. I think that's the only two things in here, opening and chamber. Oh! This looks... Okay, this is cool. Your stomach, I don't think dinner was big enough, yeah? Xeno Neo Cubism, yeah. This is an interesting looking panel. With four, but we don't have another. Rod. Gosh, okay, let's do blue, red, green, D20s, and then a blue D12. I wish there was a faster way to click through these. And what did I say? Blue D12? Oops, wait. No, I can't hold down. It only does one at a time. This, this soundtrack, this jungle animal noises echoing through a cavern is very, very different. What? Is it showing me a vision of that location? Amazing map system. You don't even have to refold it when you're done. Weird. <coughs> Excuse me. Hit, opening, panel. Indy, hi, welcome in. This room is cool. Is there anything we can pick up in here? Is this a dead end? I think so. Let's go to this opening. Did this loop around, do we think? And this comes back out at the main first chamber that we were in? Oh, I think my stomach is growling too. I'm gonna have to have a snack when we go on break. Lens. Yes. Okay. We know what to do with these at least. Looks like the warranty must have run out on this light bridge. The warranty, please. Just needs a little adjustment. Maybe we have to do it one more time. This shows this shows something. I can't quite tell what, but fun. Okay, so maybe it needs a little more adjustment. That's the sound we like. Light bridge. Wow. Wow. I don't feel like going out there. 
map room. Apparently I didn't click it. Do you think if we look at all of these we can find Brinks? Which one did we do? Orange, right? Yeah. What is the oops. What is the purple one? I don't oh, these are such a pain to input though. I don't wanna. Do you all think we have to do that? <laughs> Am I gonna miss something if I don't input all of the different combinations into this? Green D4, green D6, red D20, red D12. Special prize for 10,000 clicks. It's just so slow. Um, I kind of want an answer to that. Yeah, go ahead, Dronin. And then what was it? Green D12? I forget already. Red. Somebody should work on remaking old adventure games for the impatient gamer. Yeah, me. One of them is needed. Okay, thank you, Dronin. We'll go ahead and do it. Oh, we didn't have a reaction to that. Okay, fun. So we did orange and purple. Let's do red. Green D6, blue D4, red D20. What is this one? Red D8? God, I don't have a good memory for this right now. I don't know what is going on. Blue D4. Okay. I think this one is correct. And then... But this one we have to circle all the way around for. Blue D4. <laughs> there we go. Thank you for the hydrate. It looks like a crypt somewhere. In a way below it. A crypt? Is that what we needed? I'll do the last one just to be thorough. We got it! Okay, thanks, Dronin. Blue D4, green D4, blue D6, blue something. <laughs> Are we gonna watch a speedrun of this game too when we're finished with it? These noises. That's the ledge, I think. Okay. What was this opening again? This was a dead end, but we learned something. Oh, no, this was the light bridge. Okay. We want to go to the pit. We want to go to the chamber. I think we just want to go to the ledge. 
No kidding, it's hanging on. Tomorrow it's gonna be a high of 30. Oh no, so cold. And I think from here we want to go to this opening. We haven't been here yet. Aha! A lake. We've got strange field, and I think that's it. It's a sunny 50s here today, winter storm tomorrow. Kind of mm -hmm. life that's just on the edge of existence. Kind of life that's just on the edge of existence? A, a kind of life that's just on the edge of existence. What does it mean? It's glowing green. Do we put some green crystals in here? It won't do anything. No. Be safe in that storm that's coming. <laughs> On the edge of existence. What are you talking about, sir? What does that mean? What if we examine it? A kind of light that's just on the edge of existence. Same thing. Poke it with a stick. I can't use these two things together. Poke it with a shovel. It won't do anything. Poke it with a flashlight. I can't use these two things together. I can't use these two things what together. What the heck? It won't do anything. All right, let's look at the tablet. Do we see anything on this that looks like the strange field? No. I don't know. Time for homework. I homework. Have a good lurk cause. Good luck with all the homework stuff. Um. Yeah, I don't. Here, poke it with a tusk. It won't do anything. Use our compass. It's not going to get There's a good a signal. Here, but I'm not getting a clear reading. It doesn't point in any direction. Okay. I don't know. Do you all think we should just come back here another time? Use the scepter. I can't use these two things together. Can we use the scepters together? These are similar. But they don't seem to no. fit together. Poke it with a blue rod. I can't use these two things together. I can't use, use these, these two, two things, things together. together. I don't believe the scepter can power the light source. Hmm, that's interesting though. The scepter heats the case. We got of the this prompt already earlier when we found the scepter. We use it with the... the scepter has no effect <laughs> on this old bone. On this old bone. It won't do anything. It won't do anything. It won't do, it won't anything. do anything. I can't use these two things together. All right, fine. I don't know what to do with this strange field. Let's go swimming. I was getting pressure for the whole conversation, but I'm sorry someone stole your gift. That's crappy, especially the leaving the package there. Yeah, they left the open, empty, plastic casing envelope. It was real unfortunate. Opening. This is the same opening, right? Yeah. Okay, well... And we learned about a crypt. Ledge, tram. That's pretty much it. It's just extra rude, mm-hmm. I was wondering if, um, if they, like, saw well i said this already i was wondering if they saw the label and thought oh there's some headphones in here let me snag these i didn't think the catacomb was nearby i thought it was associated with the red door i don't think this was the red door oh but you can't tell which color is which
once they're gone, they're gone. Need to contact Mark Rober for one of his- The Glitter Bomb! I know, those are ridiculous. I watched, I think, two of those videos, because I think they were pretty long videos. But they were good. They Nothing were funny. Could this door. Nothing could open this door. What about a scepter? I can't use Oh, no, I said together. I was going to use the scepter in the, uh... Oh, in that room, back in the Nexus. But I got distracted by our break. Let's go back, because I don't want to leave that alone and forget. Hey, Sajma, welcome in. Yeah, we come in all shapes and sizes. <laughs> Never assume. But thanks for reading the Frequently Asked Questions. I made it for a reason, and I hope people do peruse it from time to time. Honestly, though, I need to relabel it as Frequently Asked Questions slash About Me, because our Frequently Asked Questions, the most Frequently Asked thing of all is just, are you going to play X game? Will you? When will you play this game? Will you play my favorite game? So I answered that. What are your cat's names? <laughs> I feel like that's common common enough. Can I play? Will you play? Is it okay if I give a hint? Yeah, I, d I guess I don't really talk about the hints in the in the fac because I have so much of it in the panels, but also important. This room makes very strange. I can't reach noises. Did I just close this again? Yes. I always leave it open and then I forget that it's open. It's kind of hard to tell if it's open or closed. Why don't you play every game ever released? I know! <laughs> How dare I choose one game at a time. Which I don't even choose one at a time. I choose like two main games and then we sprinkle other things in there. I would like ribbon. I love ribbon bread. <laughs> this the trams in this game remind me so much of ribbon. Uh, what about the most obvious question? How are you? Oh, please, no. I thought I bread. That took me a second. <laughs> I'm sorry. Five hundred twenty-five thousand six hundred minute stream. <laughs> All right, let's look at this panel. Any tram animation is instant reminder of ribbon. Fair enough. Let's see if this does things. I kind of want to do this first. I can't first. use these two things together. That won't fit. That won't no! fit. No! You were supposed to fit in the hole. It won't do anything. It won't do. It won't do anything. That won't fit. Boo! What about this? I can't use these two things. <gasps> <gasps> Something's happening! <laughs> what does this mean? <gasps> what do we do with them? I don't know. I can't use these two things. I can't We've tried use, all I can't these, these together. together. What do we? What about this now? Can we use the silver scepter? I can't use. I can't use these. It won't do anything. Uh. It won't accomplish. It won't. Boo! Accomplish I wonder if that did something in the rest of the room. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. Um. What does this say again? Wait. These. What? It's where all the crystals meet. Could we do that before?
It's where all the crystals meet. Okay, fun. What did I do? I want to exit and come back. Did I change anything in this room because of that? No, I don't think so. I broke it? No. No, 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 There's no. an undersea tunnel leading into the base of a nearby island. I don't think I changed anything. This all looks the same. I see many undersea tunnels. All I don't see the tunnels from this window, but I trust you. I guess. Not really. <laughs> I believe that I've seen tunnels from a different view. So what you're saying makes more sense than some of the other things you've said, Boston. Okay, well, maybe I did break it. What the heck? It's where all the crystals meet. Come on. Don't be shy. Do these change? Yeah, look at the one in the bottom left-hand corner when I move this. Oh, do they all do that because it's just a reflection? Alright, fine. Weird. Or do they do it based on whichever one I select? Weird. This is the one that was broken before, supposedly. I don't get it. What if I do this? No, no, go back. Can I not get to my inventory from here? Yeah, I want to do this. It's a glowing blue rod. Hmm. It's a glowing blue rod. Looks like the crystal swag next to my window. Yeah. It's where all the crystals meet. This crystal. You're kind lifeless. of uh, you're kind of pretty. This crystal is lifeless. This crystal, this crystal is lifeless. lifeless. This, crystal this crystal is lifeless. lifeless. This crystal is lifeless. Okay, fun. Now we use the silver scepter. It won't do anything. I can't use I can't use these two things together. I can't use it won't do anything. I can't use these two it won't do anything. It won't accomplish What I can't the heck? Use these two things together. Now we use our compass. There's a signal here, but I'm not getting a clear reading. No. It doesn't point in any direction. I don't think we're going to need that again. Well, let's see what happens now that these are all have all lost power. Curious. Curiouser and curiouser. <laughs> oh, these green lights remind me of that one thing in the wall. But it, it says it's, I mean, we know it's the button for the door. But they look kind of similar. Austin, hi, welcome in. Remy, hi. How are ya? I hope everyone's having a good Friday. Good time zone. I know is when the dwarves dug too deep they found a Balrog. <laughs> so did anything change up here? We still got sparks. All the doors are still open. 
The column is still a glowing. I wonder if we powered down the tram. And that one, we were supposed to power on the tram. That, that was my suspicion. Was that we needed to get that crystal to glow again so that that other tram would work. Imagine what it must have been like when the place was inhabited. Announcements on the tram system. Sorry everyone, new person in training, they touched the crystals. Well, okay, yeah. <laughs> I hadn't confirmed it, but... I think we broke the tram. Dang it. Use the silver scepter with the tram. It won't do anything. Oh, oops, I didn't mean to do that. I missed a bunch of this. Have we successfully electrocuted ourselves yet? Have we? We brought Brinks back to life. That was cool. Not with electricity, though. It wouldn't let us electrocute ourselves. It said, you have to put the wire on the dead battery before you put it on the sparks. Okay, so maybe let's get the trams working. I feel kind of bad for messing it up. A glowy pillar in a previous stream. Oh, we, yeah, we, we <laughs> got the item from the glowy pillar. Last stream, we, we learned how to bring dead things back to life, though. That's our newest trick. <laughs> it's where all the crystals meet. I do not understand this. It's where all the crystals meet. Does it matter that I have one selected, or...? Is there a diagram for this somewhere, or...? Okay, they're all glowing. Okay, now let's do this one. Nope. This is weird. Oh! Okay. So this one, since I deselected it, it shouldn't turn off. That is maybe the right place. Oh! <gasps> okay, we're doing a thing! <laughs> Does the funky triangle map have clues? Is this, you mean this? The tablet thing? Um, you know, if it does, I would rather keep brute forcing it. <laughs> yeah, asking, can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? <laughs> okay, let's try this one. I think when it gets to its brightest spot is when... So I can see that that's the brightest spot for this first pillar. And then the second one is here. And then that third one. That seems to be working. It has like varying levels of brightness when you move it up and down through all the positions.
Nice. So that was the one that was broken before, and it's working now. The logic is starting to crystallize. Oh, please. But yes, it's true. Is that the brightest spot there? Yeah. Bam! Look at us go! It's where all the crystals meet. Okay, exit before I break it again. <laughs> it's a combination lock. Oh, look at there it goes. One that tells you when they, you get closer to unlocking things. Worst security ever, yeah. Well, it's not a lock, but... Yeah. Worst, worst security on the tram controls. Anybody could come in and change them and shut them down. Or turn them back on. That was fun. I hate how we do that little spin every time we press this button. This is actually how New York City's entire public transit system runs. You learn something new every day. Yeah, sounds legit. <laughs> okay, uh... Sick. Is it this one? That's a museum tram. Nope, don't go in there. Map tram. Nope, don't go in there. Nope, nope, go back out. I clicked too many things. Open door. This is the one that was broken, I think. Yeah. I need you guys to save me from the new job. I'm skimming 77,000 line Excel documents. Oh, rip. I believe in you, but also... I welcome you to hang with us to relieve your brain. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Look, the tram's here. Still working while watching? Gotcha. That's so many excels. <laughs> Boston, I'm gonna need you to drag the camera over here with you. Don't get stuck behind the pillar. Thank you, sir. All right, let's go. Beautiful tram animation. new scenery we'll we'll see if this is where the crypt is that it was talking about from this screen I can see the nice ripple effect on the water and click on tram and tram call and spire so let's go inside epic music yeah Tramnimation. Tram <laughs> also, who said more trauma? Trauma? <laughs> this says tram. Plateau. Okay. This is very pretty purple. No, Bren. <laughs> Congratulating everyone. No. I love how slowly our, our tiny sprite walks through this screen, but when you're on top of the spire light bridges, you go like super, super fast across the light bridge. Jer Bear, <laughs> welcome in. Oh, you know it's Friday, when? Chat is going off with puns. Spire Base, which is where we came from, I think? 
Maybe? Yeah, because that's the way we're facing. But look, stone plate. I can't move this thing with my bare hands. Okay, use the it's shovel. In dirt and rubble. That's what your shovel is for. Let's see if this plate can be moved. Stone plate, Steve Austin. <laughs> Did we get it? Nope, wait. Nope. Go in the hole. <gasps> Could this be some sort of burial chamber? Okay. It's fine. I think we found the crypt. It's a roughly carved hole in the wall. Let's put a scepter in it. What purpose could this have had? It won't do anything. Boston has no sense of adventure. He just doesn't do anything. I have to tell him where to go at all times. Shutter? Oh, I don't like the noises in here. There's light seeping through from outside. If only I could see better. Well, we have a flashlight for that. It won't do anything. Shine a flashlight in the hole. I can see that there is some energy substance inside. Can we use a tusk on it? It won't accomplish anything. Can we use a shovel on it? I don't want to damage this. What? There's an energy substance? What? How was I supposed to know that was going to work? My theory and strategy of just putting items on everything is the key here. This is so pretty. It's a light switch, yeah. Okay, but now what? There's light seeping through from outside. If only I could see better. If you could see better, but we just turned on all the lights. I do not like that screaming noise. There's light seeping through from outside. If only Rod. I can't use these two things together. Scepter. I can't use these two things together. I don't understand. It won't accomplish anything. Would be fun if a point and click had a protagonist that broke the fourth wall, complain about the weird clicks and combos and such. I think I think there are. I mean, doesn't Spy Fox do that? Stage lighting, yeah. Does Monkey Island do that too? I feel like a lot of those do. But they're more geared towards kids audience what if i click this again then now we've got some decent lighting okay great now we've got some decent lighting Sick. now we've got some decent lighting now we've got some decent lighting it won't do anything i can't use these two things i don't know what i'm doing in here was this just to turn on the light and now we go back outside with the lights on Tomb. Okay, let's go back in. Because supposedly this is a burial ground. Let's use the glowing crystals on a bunch of stuff in it here. Won't do anything. It won't do anything. But it seems like the only thing I can interact with is this hole and the shutter. I can't walk further, can I? What's stopping you, Boston? It doesn't look like there's a wall there.
Did we do this already? I can't yeah. use these two things together. I can see that there is some energy substance inside. Energy substance inside. What we've pried things off like panels. Things we've pried off the walls with bones before. I can't use these two things. I don't know how to get something out of the inside of there. It won't accomplish anything. I need to get go consume food and try to read some of this book that may or may not be important for thesis. Okay, Bren, take care. Have a good rest of your Friday. Enjoy food. Good luck with reading. We'll see you around. Thank you again for the gift. Thank you, thank you. Um, shutter. There's a signal here, but I'm not getting a clear reading. What have I not used? It doesn't <laughs> point in any direction. I don't think we can just use these on the floor. Bring the jawbone back Crystal to life. Teeth, no, we've done that. Did we did we now do we've got some decent lighting. the thing where I didn't click on it? Now we've got some decent lighting. There's light seeping through from outside. If there's light seeping through from outside. If only I could see better. I don't understand, dude. Wait, what? This stone is some sort of trigger. This stone is some sort of trigger. What the hell? <laughs> We've not seen anything like that. What can I put on you to weigh it down? Or no, am I supposed to look up while I'm standing on it? Or am I gonna walk over there? While I'm... What? Came so close to standing there a bunch of times and you click somewhere else. And the game would make you walk away without stepping on it. Yeah, I can imagine, Dronin, if you know to step there, that you're just like, please, please walk onto the path. It won't accomplish anything. But I don't, I, I don't think we've seen, I mean, I see the markings on there that are unusual, so that's good. We haven't had any pressure, uh, pressure plates yet. What, do I leave my shovel here? It won't accomplish anything. It won't accomplish anything. I just don't understand. Am I supposed to weigh this I down with stuff? Or. I can't use these two things together. Like, I'm so glad that this hmm. opened the shutter. Wait, have I moved off of it yet? Does it stay down? No. Yeah. Okay. Makes the discovery all the happy happier? Yeah. Thanks for not saying anything. You get it. I appreciate it. We haven't had to say anything today about first playthrough, but no hints, no help, no tips. You know the drill. Um. Do I... Do I own something heavy? It won't do anything. I don't get it. I can't use these two things together. Maybe we were just supposed to discover that there is a switch there? Because I feel like nothing makes sense yet. I can give hints for other games, make a fake mustache out of cat hair and syrup! Oh my gosh! <laughs> You'd think with all the digging you've been doing, you'd have kept a rock or something. 
We have a rod. Oh, okay, that's supposed to like keep it stuck down. Good, 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 good. That was the thing I didn't try yet. It it definitely feels like, you know what, the strategy is just use everything in your inventory. Now we've got some decent lighting. Now we've got some decent lighting. And we know there's an energy source in there. What happens if I look up it just says hmm? Hmm. Let's go outside. Weird. Very weird. Dirt. That's not suspicious at all. There's the open. There's something smooth under the dirt. Open shutter. A lens. Oh. Light must pass through it down into. It's the lens I have. So we needed to do that as well. Okay. Does this continue to change the room? Makes this nice beam of light here. Do you have any clues on here? No. Which room would this be? Here's a big triangle. Is that the triangle in this room? Or would it be at the end of one of the tram paths? I I just, I don't know what this is showing us, but I like to think that it makes sense. It won't accomplish anything. We already looked at the hole. Now we've got some decent lighting. Hmm. I'm confused. I feel like we've done so much and it's given us so little. Okay, let's leave. What can we put out here with the lens? A glowing crystal. It won't accomplish anything. A uh, scepter. I can't use these two things together. Does it matter which scepter? It won't do anything. A shovel. It looks like it's supposed to be here. I don't want to dig it up until I know what it's for. Shine a flashlight at it. It won't accomplish anything. It's the lens I uncovered. What? Why is this so complicated? Path, tomb. Okay, let's just go down the path. I need a break from this room. Here's another lens. Just needs a little oh, adjustment. except I don't know which one is the right way yet. Another broken Not library. that way. I probably just broke it. Okay, so maybe it needs a little more adjustment. I broke it. It was working and Another I broke it. Library. I wonder if that's still different work. depending on your game Must file. Be something wrong inside the control panel. Oh. It's not the lens this time? If at first you don't succeed. 
Interesting. That's new. Another broken light bridge. It still doesn't work. Must be something wrong inside the control panel. Panel? Can we open these though? We haven't been able to open the other ones. That was so weird. this is what's in the guts of these machines. Huh? Red, blue, green. Source. Prism, 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 prism. This looks like fun. Can we move these? We can spin them. Oh, fun. Okay, red's going to red. Easy. Pretty impressive for someone who never took a class in alien. We just had to get all the right colors to go to the, all of the, the right colors. <laughs> But then we still gotta put the lens in the Another right spot. Light. No, let's just move the lens. That was a fun puzzle. It still doesn't work. Wait, how do you know? If at first you don't succeed. Dude, I don't trust you. Another broken You said it doesn't work, but I feel like it did. If at first you don't succeed. Oh, this is annoying. Another. It's. Yeah, he said it still doesn't work, but I shouldn't have listened to him. Ooh, an engraving. I haven't looked at my notes in a really long time. We have a bunch of notes of different stuff from the first day, the second day. This set, no, look at it again. It says, I can't even, I don't even know what this means. Looks like a bunch of circles, and then this thing in the center has maybe a light bridge crossing over. This is two of the two of the spires. I don't know. A Led Zeppelin album cover. <laughs> hey, Bain, well, welcome in. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Goodness. Bat creatures. Out. Platform. Are you the same bats from Symphony of the Night? The bat things are up on the ceiling. What do I have that can reach clear up there? Do I have anything? Also, I feel like someone redeemed hydrate earlier and I said thank you for the hydrate and then I didn't. I didn't actually drink water. I need to remember to keep drinking water. It's important. Do I have something? Why do we want to reach the bats? Shine a flashlight on the bat creatures. Oh, there they go! We pissed him off. 
They're cool looking. It's amazing how parallel evolution on two different worlds made bats look completely weird and <laughs> disgusting in both places. Bats are cute! Was that just an Easter egg? The bat things are up on the ceiling. Okay. Here you are, Brink. We found Brink? You haven't been answering. I was busy, trying to concentrate on my work. I don't have time for interruptions. In other words, you want me to go away. Those are the right words. Go away. I don't trust that guy. Dude, what shenanigans are you getting into up here? What are you doing? Can I click on anything else? Oh, this is a cool view. Dude, what 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 is happening? Can I not even talk to you? Brink. Oh. Let's say something profound and see if he yells at us again. Brink, I'm worried about your health. Don't be. I've never felt better. Your behavior isn't rational. What do you know about my behavior? What do you know about my rationality? No one has ever been healthier or more rational than I am right now. Okay. What's the project you're working on here? You're not a scientist. There's no way you can <laughs> understand it. Oh, I get it. <laughs> I can figure out alien technologies, turn the power on, work the tram system, adjust the light bridge lenses, Repair broken door control panels and even I did all that, not you. <laughs> but no, I'd never understand your work. I know you mean well, Commander Lowe, but I'm not working at the level of ordinary human beings right now. I did like Brink more than Boston, but. Maggie's worried about you. Okay, I am too. I'm fine, Commander. I've never felt better. <sighs> but we're just... Yeah, Boston doesn't un I'm fine. understand what he did. I'm fine! Okay. In the map room, I found hints about a secret passage under the tomb I discovered. I'm so very impressed. Now leave me alone, Commander. <laughs> These light bridges link the spires. It's a lot faster than using the trams. Is it? I've still been using the trams. <laughs> He's such a jerk. Sure, alien physics. Mm hmm Zara, hi, thanks for using your channel points for the um for the sympathy in the night challenge. Maggie's work on data retrieval is going well. I almost said map challenge. Then go talk to Maggie about it. He is so over it. With all your newfound brilliance, Brink, can you make any sense out of this? I don't have time to analyze every meaningless bit of debris you pick up and carry around with you, Commander Lowe. I'm worried that these life crystals may have side effects. The only side effect is the envy of people who haven't used them. I can't use them. I'm not dead. Their effect on health and intelligence increases with each use. What about their effect on sanity? He is hooked. These life crystals are the most important technology ever created. They are the answer to everything. Okay, if you say so. For those of you that missed the second day of stream, Brink died and we brought him back to life with life crystals. And ever since then, he's been like, he's been like, man, these life crystals make me unstoppable. He's really into the life crystals, loves them. One of the rules of writing is your characters can't just get along, which is part of what leads to the rampant quipping in MCU. Yeah. Thanks for the reminder, of course, Silas. Dude, this guy's gonna get detention. <laughs> just die so you can use the crystals. I found a bunch of these metal plates. When we've got them all, maybe we can go home. It's like Pet Cemetery. <laughs> you remember home, don't you, Brink? Earth, family, friends, food. You're doing very well, Commander Lowe. By all means, 
Go, find the rest of the metal plates. Go quickly. Go now. I have more things I want to ask you. Hang on. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing right now, Brink. But those ghosts had things they wanted us to do, and we need to get home. And you're not doing either one. What I'm doing is more important. But I'll never accomplish anything while I have incessant interruptions. <laughs> is that the last question? Yeah. That was fun. I enjoyed that. What you working on, buddy? What's this relic? This looks like some pretty badly deteriorated machinery. Okay. What if I break it? Smash it to pieces while he's working on it. The shovel is useless here. I don't know if I can do anything out here. If I owed my life to a bunch of shiny rocks, I'd probably be into them too. Fair enough. The dude's waiting for you so he to go so he can consume a crap ton of crystals, maybe. Use scepter on brink. I haven't seen one of those before. Okay, well, that was fun. Here, what do you think of this rib cage I found, dude? Isn't this cool? The ribs are jointed. Interesting. Hey, hey dude, look at that. I found this uh tusk. Isn't it neat? Enough to make any ivory poacher envious. Hey, hey dude, what about this thing? What do you think of this? Keep it. I don't want to be loaded down. <laughs> Starting to think these crystals are made of meth. I don't know what these crystals are made of. With all your newfound brilliance, Brink, oh, that we've already gotten this. Out of this. I don't have time. He just called that map thing a piece of crap. Hey, what happens if I shine my flashlight at you? Oops, I didn't mean to shine at the relic. It won't accomplish anything. Your flashlight still has a bright beam. Thanks, thanks for testing it for me. This looks like some pretty bad. Going full supervillain, maybe. Okay, what about this? I can't determine what it's made from. Such a primitive archaeology tool. All right, well, that was fun. Bye. So now what? I'll just take a screen grab of this. I don't feel like doing a diagram right now. Let's go back to the edge. As he gets down digging with his hands. I don't know what he's working on with that relic. I can't tell. Let's go back in here. I feel like I forgot the clue for this room. There's a signal here, but I'm not getting a clear reading. It doesn't point in any direction. Let's just start using the shovel on a bunch of stuff. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do in here. Break the stone. It won't accomplish anything. Can I do- just yes or no only. Can I do more in this room right now? I don't- we did- we- we found the thing that was supposed to go in the light switch, we turned on the lights, we found the- the plate? No? Okay, thank you, Dronin. I'm like, we did a bunch of stuff and none of it ended up giving us any clues. Oh, except I think I just want to go on the light bridge now? Thank you, Wiley. It's the lens I uncovered. Mm. A 
Are we all lit up? Are we still missing one? Yeah. Let's go back and... Oh! It's looking spicy. You're looking pretty. It doesn't look safe to walk there. Wow. Here, have a scepter. It won't accomplish anything. I've probably tried that a hundred times already. Okay. I can see a door, but can't touch it. I can it. see a door. What does our fancy thing, tablet thing, tell us? I don't know. I want to look at my notes. Okay, now I'm getting the notes out. Because the notes told us about exploding that one door with a bomb. or And then we knew that it was an explosive, and then we used the explosive on something else. That was upsetting. So let me see what other notes I took. Okay, canister. That's That's the one we've used already, I'm pretty sure. Something about trees and a moon and a grave. Hmm. And a gem going into a slot. Hmm. And a staircase. Yeah, never mind. This isn't helpful right now. Yeah, it is cool looking. This is the thing that brought us here? Right? At one point we were inside of one of these. D12 looking things. <laughs> okay, well my notes didn't help me. So... Let's go back to the museum spire. Go, dude, go. Walk faster. I don't think I can do anything with the broken door still. Or the ruined door, whatever it's called. What do we do in this room? Wait. Wasn't there a plate on the ground before we dug into the tomb? Did we not pick that up? That's kind of upsetting, right? When is this thing gonna be complete? This is the only piece we have left. Shallow, ind shallow, indentations. shallow indentations. Shallow One indentations. Okay, I might need a nudge for what to do next. Doors, doors everywhere. Doors, doors everywhere. It won't accomplish, it won't accomplish anything. Did you try using the task case dreams? Welcome in. We used the tusk on some things. Is this a tram we haven't called yet? This might be the answer. This might be the last tram. Maybe I just needed to come back here. So 
to place with an unsolved puzzle, use a strategy that's been working well for you. Okay. We'll keep it up. We've been doing fine. I need to keep at it. We've been here. Why? That one just says open door, but it doesn't say like museum tram, library tram. Those are more helpful. Go swimming across again. Whee! Oh my god! <laughs> he thought we died! It didn't let me do that before! That should be an Olympic event. Austin, are you okay? Why did you just jump into the abyss? Oh my god, let's save. I was I didn't think we could die in this game, but I now I don't know. That was hilarious. What in the world? Wait, this game was not saved. No, I did save. Save. Jen the astronaut. Okay. Yes. That was weird. He's so deadpan. If we die, we do get to use the crystals. Alright, the water carries you across. Are we gonna dive in again? No, we survived that time. What a weird game. This is where our friend the rat lives. I'm gonna have to draw out a map. Oh, this room. Does this room have a plate that we have to step on too? Use the tusk. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. God, I have no idea. Use the flashlight. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. I can't use these two things together. I'm gonna have to draw a map because uh, the tram system, I wanna make sure we've visited them all, right? So we've got this one that goes to the rat cave. We've got the museum, which is the first one we went to. We've got the other one, the other one, and the other one. I just don't remember where they all go. And I think we've lit up four of the five. So what are we missing? Was Brinks working on the device for the last light bridge? No, because I think the light bridge in that area was in another spot. This is confusing. No, don't go in the damn cave! Okay, so... We've got Museum Spire... We've got Spire. Why don't they give that one a name? We'll just make labels for them ourselves. This is the one that's not connected yet. 
We've got Tomb Spire. And we've got Map Spire. Oh, right, the map room. That told us about the tomb. If you know what will and won't work, just use what works. Yeah, don't, don't, don't confirm anything. I know it's hard, but, um, just let me, just let me struggle until I say safe word. Or until I, you know, we talk about looking up the walkthrough or something like that. Um, I just want to look at this spire. So this one must be the, where we just came from. This is the rat cave? Yeah, okay. And this, this one that I haven't been to must be the one with the door that's blocked, right? That has the panel that's blocked. And... Is... Um... Brinks by the tomb? And what's up with the bats? Tomb and Brink and bats. Thanks for using your channel points for those community challenges. I appreciate it. This looks like some pretty badly deteriorated. What are you working on, dude? It won't accomplish anything. That could be a really bad <laughs> idea. Okay. Oh, I forgot our little uh what was what were we calling this? What were these called? In the 90s? Oh. Yes, thank you, Nick. <laughs> I forgot that our Palm Pilot is called the Penultimate. When was the last time we called anyone? Maggie, what's up? Robbins, this is Lowe. Do you read? This is Robbins. The map shows secret rooms under the tomb I found. If the map shows them, they aren't meant to be secrets then, right? I guess you're right. There must be a way to access them. Weird. Does it have Candy Crush? No, no games on it. Oh, there is a game on this phone, but I don't like it. When my mom gave me her old Palm Pilot, I thought it was the coolest. Mm-hmm. I think that's really the only thing I wanted to ask her about. I wish you could read this inscription. I keep thinking that it really matters. Give me a chance to get a handle on their language first. I'll give your inscriptions a try when I can. Hmm. If they can make bridges out of light, you have to wonder if they can make anything else. You mean light beer? I was thinking more of a lighthouse. What? What? Get out of here. That was dumb. I wish I knew how these life crystals work. Brink's probably you getting some kind of I just maybe life. Alright. Thanks. Let's call Borden. Load a shuttle. Come in, Ken. Way out of range. <laughs> Load a shuttle. Come in, I miss Clark. our other friends. Way out of range. Makes it. Exit. <sighs> um, okay. I hope things are okay back on the shuttle. I I wonder what's happening on Earth this whole time. We've been gone for a while. Three weeks. No, two weeks. How long have we been playing this game for? <laughs> what 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 about these bats? Are they a part of the puzzle? 
Are there any bats on the tablet? I don't know. Did we meet any bird friends? We haven't met any birds. We've heard birds. It's the lens I uncovered. Oh, for noises. It won't accomplish anything. It won't do anything. And we can't take the power source back out of this hole, right? Now we've got some decent lighting. I don't think so. Now we've got some decent... How do we get back to the light bridge? Oh, it's right here. What's the one we want to go to? I think the rat cave. What was over here? The crevice. We still don't know what to do with that either. It won't do anything. It won't accomplish anything. It won't accomplish anything. It won't do anything. That won't work. Why not? It won't do anything. Julia, hi, welcome in. This feels like the games I remember from my youth, King something or other. <laughs> it won't do anything. This has been a fun one. He's such a negative Nancy. I can't use these two things together. Jovial, hi, welcome in. I'm glad you I'm glad so many of you played this and know this one. It's awesome. King's Quest, yeah. I've got to head out. Good time zone and weekend. You too, Austin. Take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. We'll see you around. I'll just be here standing next to the crevice. Yeah, right. Like I'm going to stick my hand in some crack in the rock on an alien planet. Do it. He's not negative. He's positive that he can't use these things together. <laughs> Too real. Okay. So, uh, yeah, we'll... We'll try going back to, um... No, dude, where are you going? Go this way. Where was the other that other cave? Oh, it's in it's in the it's the other way in here behind the rat cave. You know, behind the rat cave. The space rat. This room. Let's just use all of our items on everything. It won't accomplish anything. I can't use these two things together. It won't do. It won't accomplish. It won't, it won't do, do anything. anything. 
We can't. The thing that bothers me is this pedestal is in the middle. It won't accomplish. And anything. we can't. That's where we picked up the scepters. But we can't put anything back. It won't accomplish anything. I had a demo of this as a kid and never got the whole game until anything. college when I tracked it down. That's awesome. I had the same feelings with, um... Well, I had, like, Jumpstart for first grade, I think it was, and I never had the whole thing. I only had a demo, and I wanted to play the full game so bad. And then we played Zumbinis in school, and I loved it. Uh, and I never got a copy of it until much later in life that I could play it at home. I love Zumbini so much. It won't accomplish anything. <laughs> Zumbidis is so good. We played that on stream a while back, and it was all the feelings, all of the emotions with the music, and the narrator, and the pizza guy. Gold scepter with gold button. It won't do anything. It won't do anything. Why won't we stay stand- I'm sorry, what? What the hell? <laughs> I'm just clicking random things at random things. Okay, this is fine. Put away the gold scepter. We're looking out the ceiling at the solar system? I don't remember the puzzles at this point, but I do remember them being rather obtuse. Some of them have been really good. Some of them have been really, a lot of them have been really obtuse. And I've been like, let's use this thing in my inventory. What is happening? That's how you know it's a classic point and click, it's true. Oh, weird. With the ceiling, with the planet, with the large moon. Stop that. With the small moon. No, stop that. But if I put it away... Put away, put away. Oh, it won't let me. Yes, it will. It's okay, I couldn't figure out how to put it away. I just want to examine. It does go a little rub everything in your inventory on everything in the world, yeah. That's okay. It's a We've had fun with it. The smallest moon of this planet. It depicts a planet and its moons. It's the ceiling of the dome. Weird. What does our hand handy tablet say? Oh, <gasps> is this something? It has circles. Is this a moon? <laughs> no, I don't know. Let's try to line these up again. What happens if I use the other scepter? Fun. Weird. No, I didn't... Oh, this is really odd. The controls for putting away whatever's in your hand doesn't work the same as before. But that's okay. Oh. 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 
So what happens? What happens if I exit? Oh, wrong button. Whoa, cool. It depicts a planet and its moons. Perhaps it's this planet. Okay, let's do it again. It depicts a planet and its moons. Perhaps it's this planet. How do we get back there? Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Well, I want to put this here, I think. And then I want to put, oops, I did it wrong again. I'm trying to line them up with the light source. No, you come over here. Why does it keep doing that? I don't understand. Is it when I use them on the ceiling that we get a cutscene? That's where I want it. Hmm. Doesn't this look the same as where it was before? Hmm. <sighs> It feels very Outer Wilds. I'm telling you, this game was recommended to me as a follow-on for Outer Wilds, and it's been so fun. It has held up its end of the deal. I just don't know what I'm doing right now, but... That doesn't mean it's still a really cool follow-on. See, what is that? Why does it do this? This feels very cryptic. Is this, is this mean something with the light source lining up the way it is? Use the gold one again. I didn't realize it was a suggestion. Yeah, it was from our friend Wymiser, because I don't, I actually was trying to remember, I can't remember if he watched me play the beginning of Outer Wilds and was like, I need to go play this immediately. So then a few of us ended up watching his playthrough, and when he finished the game, he was like, oh, this kind of actually reminds me of The Dig, you should play The Dig. And I said, yeah, sure, I'll put it on my wish list. Is it on, because it's on Steam as one of the fun point and clicks that they put in the Steam library. And then months the later, the we finally play, we're finally playing it, which is pretty cool. So this button doesn't have an effect yet. Weird. Very weird. Porcus, hi, welcome in! This is a scepter, okay? It's one of the items we picked up. It's not actually our cursor, this is our cursor. We, you know, we've got your standard. Um, a magnifying glass, flashlight, shovel, jawbone, rib cage. Some engraved rods, some scepters, it's fine. Tunes, welcome in. There's so many. <laughs> Are they friendly, Kara? The people here? <laughs> don't worry, you're hi, gonna friends. fit right in. You're gonna fit right in. Thank you for the raid. Queen, hi. Oni girl, hi. Welcome. How's everyone doing? 
How is your stream? How's Kingdom Hearts going? It's good to see you, Toons. Why, Miser? Your ears must have been burning. We were just talking about you. <laughs> Welcome in, Raiders. Hi, I'm Jen. It's good to have you here. I'm loving the dig. It's a space archaeology mystery point and click. Happy weekend. And I was giggling when you came in, Toons, because... <laughs> Chat was pondering what this item might look like. It's just a scepter, okay? Let's not go there. <laughs> Welcome in! <laughs> Why, Miser? What? Okay. We, we, we got a little stuck earlier, but we're doing better now. Also, I'm kind of terrified of Brink. Also, we almost died falling off of a cliff with the waterfall, like the waves of water that you're supposed to use to get over the gap. We just fell in. It was really funny. Uh... It's good, Tunes. It's really, really good. Everybody go follow Tunes. Go support their stream. Thank you again for the raid. Kingdom Hearts 3 is going well. We nearly finished Horizon Forbidden West. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Such a beautiful game. Skeptical Scepter. Um, we're in the middle of this puzzle with moons and planets and light sources. And I feel like we're trying to make an eclipse happen. But it's it's never gonna happen. Stop trying to make eclipse happen. This puzzle probably took me the longest, but I was also 10. What puzzle did we do earlier that I really liked? Oh, the spinny, like, light prisms one was, was cute. That was fun. Yeah, I can't really tell what the goal is. Um, but I know that that moves the planet and this moves the moon. Oh, we did it. <laughs> what is that? There's our little rat friend. <gasps> they locked us no. in. Why is that door closing? He didn't steal that part again, did he? I'm trapped in here? Okay, wait, don't tell me the answer to the puzzle yet. So we were moving the planet and the moon, and then the moons in the sky were all was also moons? Moon? Big moon, small moon. Yeah, 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 the moons. We were moving the moons. And they were also moving in the sky. But was it to get the moons in the sky to reflect the sun onto that spot on the planet? Is that what we were trying to do? That was very obscure. Classic rat stuff. <laughs> Poor kiss. Okay, and now we're trapped. So if I move the moons again, that'll undo what we did, right? Is this just a- this is just a button to open it, right? Controls still work on this side. It's fine. Was this crack anything? Why can we interact with the crack? <laughs> you can answer that. I can see outside. Let's go. Before we get locked in again by the rat. It's for cracking jokes. You all are doing that plenty without the crack in the wall. Okay. Now we go back to... The tomb. If you click on the crack before opening the door, he says something about the creature. Oh, okay. Well, I missed it. Do you know where the other side of the crack is? The crevice? No, I don't know. Oh, 
We didn't need a clue. We just pushed the button. It was easy. Oh, now it has a name. Planetarium Spire. I was calling it the Rat Cave Spire. <laughs> we want to go back to the tomb. He said, I can see outside. I don't know where outside. It's fine. Don't worry about it. No, no more answers for now. We'll, we'll cover all the things I missed when I finish the game. Um, what time is it? Oh, dang. Okay, we're almost at four hours. That's all right. We were, we're trying to finish it today. I would like to finish it today. Um, we want to go to... Not the bat cave. We want to go this way. I thought those moons were in a synchronous orbit. What could have caused the moons to move? We caused them to move. You dork. It's the lens I uncovered. The larger moon is being eclipsed by the smaller one. Good job. What could have happened? The only puzzles I remember are the beginning of the crater and one thing at the end, which I had to use a guide for, yeah. Petition to rename Planetarium Spire to Rat Cave Spire. Rat Jam! <laughs> so, uh, this is cute. This statue is life-sized. Dude! I hope I don't get kicked out for destroying the exhibit. You were just supposed to look at it! You weren't supposed to touch it. Can we bring it back to life? What a dork! Boston, keep your hands to yourself. Ready, let's bring an alien to life. That's not gonna help me. Aww. Get slab. Let's use a shovel on a crypt. That won't help me get anywhere. <laughs> Worst archaeologist ever. Yeah, he's the astronaut. He's not an archaeologist. He's like the commander leader astronaut. But damn. <laughs> Brink, come help me lift this with your superhuman strength. I am so upset. What if we use the glowing crystals on that thing before it turned to dust? Can we go back to the planetarium and bring it to life again? Just do over. Um, now what? Here, that's not going to help me get beneath this. Line. Yeah, it is. Let's go look at the hole. Now we've got some decent lighting. Hmm. Hmm. So helpful. So What else did that eclipse do? It just did this, right? And then it showed us the rat closing the door. My laptop died and with it momentarily my poor heart because my TV went off too. <gasps> no, Loki. Yeah, there's really scary noises in this room. I don't know what's making them.
shine the flashlight back at it. Oh, do we use our magnifying glass? That can't reach the moon. That <laughs> can't reach the moon. <laughs> Here, use this to fry the light, or fry an ant, or whatever. I don't think you can actually it's use so this thing so like you would on an ant, you know? It's an entrance. It's an entrance. <laughs> oh, goodness. Ant frying stream, yeah. Now that I know there's something under this crypt, there's got to be something I can do to move this lab. Call Brink and bring him over. Use your palm pilot. Brink, help me move the slab. Brink, come in, Brink. He doesn't answer his phone anymore. He just goes, leave me alone. Brink. He's decided to play hide and seek. Go away. Well, I don't have time to waste on children's games. Um What's going on with the bats? I know, but wouldn't that be cool? Y'all don't need me you all don't need to correct me on that one. Just let me play with the magnifying glass. <laughs> let let me let me live my life and use the wrong items. Okay, hi Brink. What's up? Brink. Brink. In the map room, I found hints about a secret passage under the tomb I discovered. Mm -hmm. I'm so very Come help impressed. me. Now leave me alone, Commander. Boo. Okay, fine. I'll leave you alone. Let's call uh, Maggie on our Palm Pilot. Robbins, this is low. Do you read? This is Robbins. The map shows secret rooms under the tomb I found. If the map shows them, they aren't meant you to be seen. You said that last then. time. I guess they're. Mo <sighs> now you're Thanks. being the negative, Nancy. Are we supposed to do something with the bats other than upset them? Everyone is so sassy. Yes! 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 Cute little bats. Uh, thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting a fellow human. It's kind of fun to disturb these bat things and make them fly around. <laughs> But does it serve a purpose? Is this just a fun pastime? Are they all gone now? No, they're still all here. Of course, if I keep doing this, one of them is bound to put some guano on my head. Plus 10 for including that word in a video game. I know, they're cute. I like bats. Alien or otherwise. Guano. <laughs> right in my eye. Nasty. Okay, well. The bat things are up on the ceiling. Nice. Disgusting bat things. No. I hate disgusting bat things. Oh, I don't know where we're supposed to go. Are we, so can, do we have what we need to solve the tomb puzzle right now? You can answer that. Just yes or no. We do. Okay. That's all I need. We didn't get a sample of bat guano for the inventory. No. <laughs> it 
If you don't know, that's fine. Just let let the people who know answer yes or no. It's directed to them. I remember learning what the word guano was as a child and just oh, all we needed to do was step on it. Perfect. Love lovely. Um, and just thinking, oh wow, I'm so smart, I know this cool, unique word for this gross thing. You know, when you're a kid and people go through that phase of they're like, oh, the word dude means... I don't know, something about an elephant butt, and you all think it's the funniest thing in the whole world? Or was that just a 90s kids thing and nobody does that anymore? Also totally fair. We did it! We solved the puzzle! Why did we not stand on the elevator before? What's wrong with us? Because I was too busy using a shovel on it. Fun. Broken bones. Fun. That's what this says when I hover over it. Okay. Your dermis is showing. <laughs> yeah, that was a line in a Bill Nye the Science Guy video, right? Your epidermis is showing. <laughs> That's what happens when we play games from our childhood. We all revert to childhood humor. Alright, well, I guess we'll go examine the broken bones. Inertia is a property of matter. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, this is not the type of science that I want to experience right now. Just casually walking away. Oh, now suddenly we've got guard dogs. Where did he come from, anyway? Okay, well, they're not chasing us. Here, have a bone. Here, doggy. That wouldn't work with this creature. No? Here. That wouldn't work with this creature. Can we pet it? It just rose up out of a pile of bones near the door. Yeah, go pet it. After a crystal fell from the wall. Mm -hmm. Not a bad system of keeping guard dogs around. Even if they die of old age, just drop a crystal on him and there he is again, barking his brains out. Um. That wouldn't work. Do you like way. bats? What if I disturb the bats? Will you chase them? about this other one there's still a little flesh clinging to these old bones just go up to the door <laughs> let's call it muffin that creature won't let me near the door um i don't know use a shovel that wouldn't okay, work. good. I'm glad that didn't work. Muffin's breathing is a little labored. They're having a rough time. They just got revived from being dead from who knows how long. He just rose up out of a pile of bones near the after a crystal. Not a bad sip, even if they die. Okay, we got that already. Um did we use the jaw? That wouldn't work with this creature. I like the idea of throwing it a bone, but there's also a pile of bones right next to it. It doesn't seem interested. Okay, what about this thing? There's a signal here. 
I want to know where our rat friend is. The wind effect in this chamber is really good because it keeps making me think, like, is it windy outside my house? Also? Or is it just the game? Work is done for the evening. Thank you, fellow humans, for keeping me company. We're going to try to catch up over the weekend. Sounds good, Otterly. Yeah. I'm glad it's done for tonight. Yeah, I guess we'll go back up. Can I skip this cutscene? Yeah. Really tired, but we have a deadline. Gotcha. Okay. Here. I need a water, water break too. Nope. I don't think it did anything. More guano. Guano. Right in my eye. Gross. Hey Shadier, welcome in. This game is from 1995. First two weeks on the job, nailing the paycheck. <laughs> nice. Do we go see what Brink thinks about the dog? Reminds me of a game I played as a kid and don't recall the name. I don't think I played anything quite like this. But we've been talking about a lot of different games. Brink. Oops. Oh, no, I didn't mean to click out of that menu. It takes so long to get him to respond to me. Brink. Brink. No, there's no menu item for the dog. Ah. Is this above where the... Oh. What? Throw the shovel off the cliff. Use shovel I with can't down. These two things together. You think this is it, Shadier? That's amazing. I've been racking my brain for so long. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad we played it. Full Throttle has similar vibes, similar landscapes. Oh no, excuse me. Uh, tough dude protagonist, same or similar version of the engine. Yeah. You can see the bridge centerpiece from here. I don't think my computer had high enough resolution for that. Is that what this is? Or is it when I look down? I Oops. can't use these two things. It's so pretty. I want to dig everything because the game is called Dig. Yep. We've got to dig a fair amount today. We finally used our shovel on some things. Oops, I don't want to use it again, though. What do, what do, what do we throw the tusk? It won't do anything. Throw the crystals. I can't use these two things together. Throw the ribcage. I can't use these, these two, two things, things together. together. Um, there's a novel for this game. Anything. Yeah. Oh, Redbeard, hi, welcome in. Brink told us he's working on something, but he's very salty. He's not very conversational. Pretty much everything we bring up, he's like, yeah, I don't care. Leave me alone. Brink is unimpressed by the shovel. Um... I can't use these two things together. I don't know why 
right, it lets us look down there. We can examine Brink. Hmm. hmm. Okay, nice. I remember Mist having a bunch of novels. I really couldn't read them at the time. Yeah, we talked about those when I played through Mist. I should pick them up, or at least one. Brink did have a rough day. Been here from the beginning, uh, but just saying hey now, I was doing house stuff. Nice, thanks for the lurk, I appreciate it. Having a really good Friday. Chores gang, I know. I do that too, I have a stream on just the audio and do chores sometimes, it's really helpful. I want a shirt with that magnifying glass, and I can't use these two things together. Mm-hmm. This day was a killer. I played Mist, um... What is it called? I forget. Real Mist Masterpiece Edition on Steam. The playthrough for that is in my collections tab in the videos thing on Twitch, if you are interested. But that's the only one that I've done um, there's a whole tab for puzzle games in the, in the collections. I've got The Witness, Mist, Pajama Sam? Did we put Pajama Sam in that collection? Baba is you. Good stuff. Alright, I'm getting a little distracted. Baba is me? <laughs> Baba is Baba. Baba is difficult. I don't know what to do. Look at us go. This area is very peaceful. I think Mist got better and better as it went along in sequels, yeah. I've played- oh, and I was gonna say, I've played Riven, but not on stream. I actually played Riven first as a kid, and really loved it, and always had Riven on my, like, must-play someday list, and I finally played it on stream. I considered replaying Riven on stream, but I don't know that I want to do a replay when I have so many other games that I've never played. I also used the guide a lot because I was I was young and impatient and didn't know how any of the puzzles worked. Grim Fandango would definitely fall in that category. I haven't played that on stream either. We've just talked about it a lot. This is on Steam. No, Shady, or you can buy this on Steam. For like 10 bucks, I think. Or wait till it goes on sale. Very easy to, to purchase. I've liked your choice of games. Long time lurker, I guess. How do you decide what to play? That's a good question. Um, How do we decide what to play? <laughs> Right now, I have... maybe this diagram helps us. I have a running category for puzzle games, Metroidvanias, and then I don't have anything else planned after Subnautica. Subnautica was sort of the follow-on to Outer Wilds exploration type games. But lately we've been sticking to those two main categories and just adding to it and then throwing other stuff in when we feel like it it's hard to pick it's hard i have a channel in the discord called game suggestions and there's a pinned message that's like my ever-changing list of things for that year and we just try to knock out as many as we can Mist three and Mist four recommendations. Thank you, Jovial. That's awesome. Yeah, I I kind of forgot that there's more to it than just Mist and Riven. Wang a dude. Hi, welcome in. Have you been playing the dig this whole time? Please. Yes, we have. <laughs> and this is stream number three. And I thought we were gonna finish today, but I don't know that we are. This symbol here. 
was the one on the weighted thing on the floor. I do not know what this is. Ugh. Wait, this isn't where I want to go. I want to go back to the dog. Macchiato, hi, welcome in. How are you? I've been looking at new glasses, but I like these ones so much. And I, I was going to order some online, but I want to be able to try them on and make sure they fit. I was going to get some blue light blocking glasses. Never change them. I just wish they had blue light blocking lenses. Doing okay? Gotcha, gotcha. $5.99 on Steam. There you go. If you want to play this game, it's $5.99 on Steam right now. This dog is so loud. Calm, please. Gotta change glasses sometimes. They get scuffed up, yeah. These, um, well, these are not exactly, oops, sorry, I hit the mic, not exactly prescription, so they can get pretty scuffed and I can still wear them, but I love them. I wear them every stream. Thank you, SoCal. Also, we're talking about the, uh, oh, sorry, the Discord quite a bit. If you're not in there and you want to join, there's a link for you. Um, you'll have to wait till probably either later or after stream to get your permissions, but you should be able to go in and, and read stuff. Have you played Sable? No, that's on my wish list, Wangadoo. Played for four hours, a chill exploration game, open world. Yeah, that would be a good one. After Subnautica, maybe. I think I saw Kim Chica playing it and immediately put it on my wish list. There's still a little flesh clinging to these old I don't know. Can we do what we need to do in this room? Or do I need to leave and come back? Safe word, you can answer that. It's free on Game Pass. Oh, nice. We can do... Okay. What if I throw the bone so that it chases the bone? I can't use these two things together. That creature won't let me near the door. There's not really anywhere to throw it. I guess we're gonna revive the other creature, and then maybe they'll run off together. The ugly twins. They're gonna fight? Oh god! <laughs> I thought they were gonna be friends and run off together and, you know. Dead guards. Let's bring them back again. No, let's leave. That was gruesome. I can't get it open. This game is dark. That could be a really bad idea. Why? A life crystal fell from this slot and resurrected that guardian creature. Are we supposed to put a crystal in the slot? That could be a really bad idea. Yeah, I was not expecting that. A medium upset. Oh, goodness. Go through the door. I can't get it open. What the heck? Is this is this thing for this thing? There we go. It evaporated when the engraving touched the slot. This is the engraving we found in the shipwreck. The one the first ghost gave us. We've had that this forever. Must be where the ghost wanted us to come all along. Oh, we get to keep it, too. I 
If you look real close, there are five symbols on that panel. I could see symbols, but it kind of looked like... Well, it kind of looked like four, or just dots, not like the different dice, but yeah. As if chucking resurrection stones at bloodthirsty monsters was, right, so called? What, what, what kind of logic is at play here? It was the item from the demo that I never used. Gotcha. Okay, I guess we go to this pyramid. Oh, now we... Oh. Maggie, I found something. It's far below the tomb, past some pretty ugly guards. A dead alien sealed inside a crystal pyramid. Sounds like they went to a lot of trouble to hide it. Must have been important to them. A king or something. Or it terrified them. Is this Remember, in... this is the land of the life Is crystals. this in my, in my notes? Dead doesn't necessarily mean dead dead. Maybe they were trying to keep it from being found and revived. But this is where the ghost wanted us to go. The key to the last door was the key that the first ghost showed us, back in the ruined spaceship. Still, you don't have a key to the pyramid, right? Besides, It definitely I mean, has five symbols on it. Brink died by digging where the ghost pointed. I hate not having enough information. Brink died as fast as I can to get not this because he dug in that location. I'm so close, I can taste it. Fine, keep working. Call me if you think of anything. He died because he fell down the hole that he dug. Alien corpse. Looks like a panel. Yeah, it looks like a panel. It's a rod. Sick. It's the remains of a huge creature. Let's save. We're gonna save our game. Jen the astronaut, that's me. Okay. This is bad vibes. No, we're gonna bring it back to life. What could go wrong? Here we go. Climax of the game. We look so sad. He's very tall. Or I'm very Oh, it's short. a chocobo. I wish I didn't keep thinking of the term bite size. <laughs> Please be friendly. I hope you're friendly. I'm certainly friendly. <laughs> Let's all be friends. <laughs> Oh, sick. Now more Chozo than Chocobo. I get it. Here. Does this mean anything to you? Yeah, totally. Say something profound. I'm Boston Low, and I've got two crew members around That's not here profound. Somewhere. We're stuck here, and we need help. This is amazing. How does it feel to be alive again after all these years? I can't believe I said something. So <laughs> what are those ghosts that were giving us hints now and then? Yo, I'm your biggest well, fan. Hey, thanks. It's been great talking to you. So long. We should do this again sometime. <coughs> Later. Oh, well, you don't just stand there and wait for us. Better tell Maggie about this. Okay. What she's looking at looks kind of like our tablet. Maggie. Come in, Maggie. We don't get to see her face close yes. up very often. What? Maggie, you won't believe what just happened. Boston, I think I've got it. <gasps> I've got the language. Yes! I can read this go, Maggie, now. go! Can you speak it? Because I've got this. But take this inscription here. I'm uh oh, sure uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Maggie, Maggie get out of there! My mind must be No, Maggie. What were you saying about 
No! What do you want? What's happening? What's going on? Boston! Frank! Leave from me! No! The best character in the whole game! Come in, wherever you are, we need you. Something's happened to Maggie. Damn. Go, go, go! Go get her! Walk faster! You're so slow! We gotta go save Maggie! Oh my gosh, could you be any slower? Uh, light bridge is this way. Boston walks so slow. Oh, this is it right here. We're in this one, right? Yeah. Oh, BB is at the door. I'll let her say hi in a second. Are we gonna die in here though? Because this thing attacked her. It's gonna attack us. She's gone. Where is she? Not a trace. Oh. Not a sign of struggle. Oh. Nothing. But she has the answers. The if this is a library, then this must be where you search and retrieve data. Okay, BB wants to say hi. Just casually taking the scenic route has our friend gets attacked, yeah. We do have resurrection crystal, she'll be fine. 